studies. Welcome back to Sense Business Studies. Please do subscribe and if you find this video useful, don't forget to like. Also, I have my own YouTube channel called Crazy RTCSE where I teach seven subjects and also teach solved past papers of RGCSE syllabus. So don't forget to subscribe there as well. So now we're looking at PPC curve, which is called production possibility curve or PPF, which is the production possible frontier. So because resources are scarce and have alternative uses, a decision to devote more resources to producing one product means fewer resources are available to produce other goods. That's why we use a production possi possibility curve diagram to show the combination of the maximum that two goods that can be produced by an economy with all the available resources. Now for an outward shift to occur in a PPC curve, an economy would need to discover or develop new raw materials and also it will have to uh, invest new technology and production methods to increase the productivity and efficiency and increase the labor force by encouraging birth and immigration, increasing the retirement age and many more factors. And there are many points for this. So now let's see how a PPC curve looks like. So here, this is the PPC curve. Now either here it will be good X and good Y. Or you could also write consumer good and capital good. So these are the two things you can write on the axis. Now you have one over here, for example. And for example, the country has invested new technology and thus there is more resources available and there is more efficiency that means there will be an outward shift so we draw the curve like this after this line and over here for the first point it will be marked over here so x1 and you could do here as sorry uh, y1 and here as x1 so then now since you having an outward shift, the shift will be going further. So here you have y2 and then x2, which means it's increasing. And you also have to show the movement by drawing the arrows. And if, for example, there has been war or some natural disaster and the resources get depleted so then there will be an inward shift so this is the original and then it will go inside we need to show the arrow to show the points so now here if it is y1 and x1 here to be going down so here you can see the consumer good will increase and the capital goods will decrease so this is an example and also there will be PPC curves like this where there will be points on different positions and you will have to identify uh, whether it is a which whether it is a good situation or a bad situation for example if they ask you to identify what is happening at the blue point in the country it means that the country is not making use of its resources efficiently and then if it is on the curve it means it is doing it's doing uh, perfect and if it's outside like example over here it's not really possible that uh, the, the country can achieve outside that point so this is the end of our topic. Hope you found this video useful and acquired enough information on the PPC curve. And if you did find this video useful, please do like and also don't forget to subscribe. And thank you for watching Science Business Studies.